Good morning guys, welcome back to my channel. So today is going to be the start of a really fun week for me. So I'm going to be giving my bedroom an extreme sort of makeover and um, it's going to be so exciting. It's not really been that long since my mum and dad decorated my room like into the black and white that's in there now. Like literally it's not even been a year, it's so bad. <laughs> but um it just something about it just wasn't like me like it wasn't cozy it felt really cold but yeah i just thought this new year after the year we've had i'm going to treat myself and decorate my room just how i want it to be so i'm going to be doing that and i'm honestly so excited and i just thought i'd obviously take you guys along with me just because i love watching like room decor videos like transformation stuff i honestly love it so i just thought this would be really fun for you guys to come along with me but yeah i should probably stop waffling on and get on with the decorating so yeah, let's go and decorate my room. Good morning guys so it's the next day now and um, all of our white base coat sort of thing is dry now and um, so hopefully we'll be able to paint the color over the top and um, I need to go and pick that up today me and Dan are about to go to the shop to pick up the paint and just collect a mirror that I ordered and um, for my fireplace because I'm really like not loving the one that's on there right now and um, but yeah I'm super excited to start actually painting the color like the white took forever obviously because it was black we had to put the white on to try and make it easy to paint over but the black just kept showing through like it was literally impossible <laughs> but yeah anyway i'm super excited to go and get the color i'll obviously take you along with me so yeah let's just go and pick up the paint come on let's get painted Okay guys, so I'm just taking a break now. I'm halfway through doing this wall, but I'm absolutely knackered and I've not eaten anything. Um, so I'm just gonna go downstairs and grab some dinner. My grandma's over, so we're gonna have Sunday lunch. And honestly, I can't wait. I'm really out of breath. <laughs> Um, this is hard work but yeah i will just see you after i've eaten okay guys so i've put my second coat on these two walls now so fingers crossed that's them finished i'll obviously find out tomorrow when i see that in the daylight and um, and then i've just finished putting the whole wall it's like first coat on that wall um but yeah there isn't really much else i can do now like the other walls are too wet to paint um, like again so I'm gonna have to leave that until the morning so yeah I'm just going to relax get into my PJs and just chill for a little bit while I edit a video so yeah I'll just see you guys in the morning good morning guys so it's the next day now Um, please excuse the look I honestly look terrible right now Um, but I just thought there's no point in, like washing my hair and making an effort if I'm just gonna be painting all day so this is the look we're going for um but yeah I just thought I would say hi and just take you along the rest of the painting journey it's gonna be a bit of a difficult one because we're having some issues with the walls over there I'll just show you these walls we painted like literally first thing yesterday and it's still not dry because we're having some issues with damp and um, the same with the fireplace that's struggling when we took off the wallpaper yesterday we accidentally popped some of the plaster so that needs polyfilling but yeah it's going to be one of them that's going to be difficult so my dad's going to come and help me to try and fix that but yeah hopefully we can try and get my bedroom back to normal because honestly it is a state right now but yeah anyway let's just get on with today's painting okay 
Okay guys, so we've had to take a quick break just because we're having a few difficulties. Um, we've had to fill the holes in the wall obviously, so we've got to wait for that to dry. Um, that paint is still not drying and we've had an issue with these walls too. And um, the paint seems to be sort of like flaking off, which is really weird. Um, so we're just having to take a moment to try and figure out what we need to do to fix this. Like I don't know if you can see there, it's like gone all flaky. It's really weird. So yeah, hopefully we can figure out how to get that fixed. But for now, we're just gonna have to leave it like this. It's such a mess, it's making me so stressed. <laughs> but yeah, anyway, I will just update you once we've figured out what we're doing. Excuse the fact I look different to Ollie. I've got changed because I'm about to go to my grandma's. Um, but I just wanted to update you quickly on the painting situation. So we've not really done much since I last spoke to you. Um, all I've done is I've just sanded this wall here down and um, just sort of smoothed out where the cracks were and then I've painted over it. Again, like the whole entire wall. Um, in the hope that that means it won't be all flaky and horrible this time but i'm just gonna have to leave that to dry and see so while that's drying i'm just off to my grandma's now um, and i'll obviously pick the rest of this up when i'm back okay guys so i'm back in my painting stuff now i look horrible i've taken out my extension like ponytail thing so i look really bold <laughs> um but I've just come back and it's not worked with the wall really. There's still patches that are still peeling. Um, so I'm gonna try and sand it a little bit more with like some ruffler sandpaper um, and just see <laughs> and hope that it goes right this time. So yeah, I'll just take you along with me. Okay guys, so I've not really vlogged in a while, um, but I've basically just done all that I can do. I've just put a little bit of colour on the wall that we're having a bit of trouble with. That's like a damp wall basically, just to see how that goes. So I've left that to dry now and I'm going to just check that in the morning. Um, I don't know if I mentioned the wall that I previously had, like the flakiness on. We're now having issues because I basically, I sanded it down. Um, and then repainted it and now it's getting little bubbles in <laughs> which is a nightmare but i'm hoping once it's dried they'll just sort of like like flatten out and um, because some at the top have gone now um which have basically just dried out but yeah i'm absolutely knackered now so i'm just gonna head off to sleep and i will see you again in the morning okay good morning guys so it is the next day again i don't even know what day we are on of painting like what day is it tuesday saturday sunday monday tuesday day four of painting um things are getting better luckily and um, the bubbles have disappeared from the paint on this wall um which is good which means this wall's basically finished so yeah let's just get straight back into painting So we've just pulled out the wardrobe and um, to try and paint behind there hence the crazy mess behind me and um, but it's not good news there is mold and damp all behind my wardrobe which is horrible and um, honestly it's disgusting i'll show you in a second and um, so we're gonna have to treat that which means it's gonna take even longer which by the looks of it, it looks like i am not staying in here tonight <laughs> cardboard there oh it's soaked guys so i just wanted to update you quickly i've just popped out now i'm just going to nip into b and q because we've run out of paint so i'm just going to go and get another tin of that so hopefully we can finish it i honestly don't think it's going to be finished for at least a couple of days just because of like all the damp and stuff behind the wardrobe because we need that to like thoroughly dry out but anyway it's freezing in this car so i'm just going to nip into b and q and get home okay guys i think i might be cursed um because i've just been into b and q and they've run out of the base for the paint that i need <sighs> so I'm gonna have to try and drive to another one. I, I don't even know where the closest one is now. But just what we needed. <laughs> uh, why do these things happen to me? Right. 
let's get driving. <laughs> okay guys, so I've just got back in the car. I am so thankful. It was literally the last tin of the paint that I needed. Other than that, they would have run out. So I'm so glad, honestly, like so thankful. Whoever was watching out for me then. Um, but yeah, now it's time to drive home. I'm gonna have to get some petrol because otherwise I might not make it. But yeah, back to the mayhem of my crazy bedroom painting. <laughs> Okay guys, so that is my finished room makeover. I am honestly so happy with how that's turned out. I absolutely love my new room. Um, it feels so cozy and like, oh, it's just amazing. I love it. Um, so I'm so glad that I did this, even though we did come across quite a few problems. Um, it turned out just perfectly. Um, I also need to say like a special thank you to like everybody who helped. So like Dan, my dad, Dan's dad, my mom, <laughs> Sam, everyone, honestly, thank you because I don't think I would have been able to do this by myself I did think I'd be able to do it just me easy but no it didn't turn out that way so <laughs> thank you to all the people that helped I'm definitely thinking of doing a room tour for you guys in another video but I'm not quite finished with my bedroom right now and um, I just want to change like some of the pictures like get some new prints um, and then I'll do the room tour but I promise there'll be one coming but yeah thank you so much for watching guys I really hope you enjoyed watching this transformation if you did please do give this video a big thumbs up and subscribe if you haven't already and I'll see you again in my next video bye guys